Tony Turner and Joanne Ball. 57 Mountain News at 6. Good evening, everyone. The battle lines From the late 1980s until June 2002, he was, he was probably the most familiar face in the mountains. There's not a, a, a holler uh, in eastern Kentucky I don't think that I've, I've not been in. From the biggest stories. War in the Persian Gulf hits home tonight. For the first time in three decades, a sitting president will visit eastern Kentucky. To issues and answers and election nights. Hal Rogers declared victorious tonight and special events that took him across the country. Of course, the Hazard and the Corbin marching bands also participating in this week's inaugural. Central Park offers its visitors a chance to escape. Tony Turner did it all at WYMT. Welcome back to WYMT Studios as we celebrate the station's 10th anniversary. And he had fun doing it. Susan, I'll ask you a question. Did you ever think that the chair that you're sitting on could be a part of uh, history someday? No. Yeah. Well, the furniture... <laughs> <laughs> it's that laugh and many other qualities that those of us who knew Tony personally still miss every day. But Tony was not only our boss, he was a friend, son, brother, husband, and father to Courtney and Cameron, who were just kids in 2002. I interviewed Courtney a few months after she lost her dad. I just miss everything about my dad because he was um, a good person and a good dad to me and Cam. Ten years later, Courtney and Cam, who both look so much like Tony, have grown up. Courtney just graduated from high school and will study broadcasting at Eastern Kentucky University in the fall. She recently received a scholarship from WYMT named in her dad's honor. Ever since I was little, you know, this is what I've wanted to do. And now that I'm older and I've never steered away from it. And this is just what I've wanted to do my entire life. And now that I'm actually doing it, it's a really surreal feeling. Courtney told us about one lesson she and many of us learned from her dad. Be personable. You have to be able to talk to somebody and you know even if they're not your favorite person you still have to be nice. Kind of kill them with kindness. And who knows in a few years there might be another Turner in the hollers of eastern Kentucky bringing us the news. That's all the time we have for now. Thank you for your time. CBS Evening News comes up next. Have a good night everyone.